to do is just go through and just kind of pry it up just a little bit just to give it a little bit easier handling because um, some of this fits really tight on there and you can bend it back and shape it's aluminum is what I'm working with I'm not working with vinyl but I just like to loosen it up just like that on both sides um, I learned this by <laughs> not doing it the first time and I fought myself for about 20 minutes so it wasn't fun it wasn't too hot so it wasn't miserable but um, yep, just like that and so it should go on fairly easy this part is going to go right around this part so it goes on like this. So it looks like it's too big, but you're going to bend this down once you get both sides on. And I don't think I can pull this. I don't think I can film it. I'm going to try and film it. Okay, that's how it went on the outside. This is how it went on the inside. We're super smooth when you open it up a little bit. Um, do yourself a favor, open it up a little bit, don't fight it. And definitely do it before you get up on the ladder. So now I've got to um, measure from the inside of here because that's where the other gutter is going to sit all the way over to my space uh, right tight up against the wall. Um, and then I'll put the end cap on which is over here and Left is left, right is right. So if you're looking at it, it's left. If you, um, you know, if you're looking at it and it's on the right, it, this would say an R on there. And these go on really simple too. These get put on just like this and like that, and it goes underneath this lip. I'm not gonna put it on this side because that's way too much of gutter. But that's, it's really simple. Um, and you use that sealant um, to seal it up. You will need sealant for this because you cannot use tape.